I'll never forget as long as I live, I, 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 I took off, I got in the car, filled it up with gas, and I decided after 20 some odd years that I was going to go visit my sister. I hadn't seen, I had laid eyes on, on my sister in, in, in 20 years at that particular time, and um, and I made up my mind, I'm going down there, I'm going to go go lay my eyes on her. We, and so I, I got to the hotel. And I hit her up on Facebook. I said, where are you? Um, what's your address? And she thought I was getting ready to mail her uh, some flowers or something like that. And, and then I pulled up at the door, knocked at the door. And when she opened up the door, the flowers was me. And we spent that whole day together. And it, it was during a, 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 a tumultuous time in my life. And we sat down and we had a, we had a uh, we went to a park and it was it was beautiful um she lives uh in douglasville georgia and that that place oh my god it's just gorgeous anyway <clears throat> so what had happened was at during this conversation she says you know i'm i'm venting i'm saying with, with this that and the other thing and what what this one did what that one did and oh my god yada 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 and she says she says to me uh, well, you, you need to, 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 to look at the common denominator. And that thing went right over my head. It just went right over my head. Why? Because, you know, I'm looking at everything else and I'm trying to analyze everything else. I'm trying to analyze everybody else. And I'm sitting back and the common denominator was me. I had to look at myself. I had to say to myself, you want to know something? You know, you know, this ain't everybody else. This is me. OK. And, and you have to have that insight about you. You need to know you. All right. So that you can explain yourself to other people so that they don't take you the wrong way. A lot of things that, that a lot of people do, they don't mean any harm. A lot of things that people say uh, uh, in life, uh, they don't mean any harm. Uh, the, the problem of, uh, of it is that, you know, people can be uh, perceived wrong, wrongly, taken the wrong way. Um, their body language speaks one thing while their mouth is speaking something totally different. And, 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 the, truth of the, and the truth of the matter is a lot of people don't mean any harm at all. Uh, but at the same time, because they can't see themselves, they don't even recognize that they're doing half of the stuff that they're doing. That's why we need to take that introspective look at ourselves so that we can, can have discretion because it will preserve. And, and then we have an understanding. You know, the best thing you could do in life is understand you. Let me try that. Let me try that one more time. I need to say that and you need need to write that down. The best thing in life you can do is understand you. Um, some years ago, I preached um, a, a, a message and I believe a series on it was talking about getting in touch with your singleness. And uh, somebody brought it up to my atten attention that you need to read that. You need to you need to uh, to listen to that sermon again. I said, OK, I will. And, you know, in essence, you know, sometimes you need to get in touch with you. You, you need to have that that insight about you. OK, so, you know, what is it about you that you like? What is it about you that you don't like? Um because if you don't like it, trust me, somebody else is not going to like it. And so the best thing you can do is make a choice to change it if you can. Now, there's there's some things about you you just can't change. All right. And I, I that's why I tell most individuals when you get into a relationship of any sort, whether it's a friendship, whether it's a, a love relationship, whether it's a business relationship, whatever it is. If you can't love these people for who they are, would you leave, please leave them alone? Morning, man.